Welcome back to Same On Gaming. This is Checkpoint School. School is now in session, noobs. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, everyone. This is the PS4 version after the gunning, run gunning, gunning, running, whatever, gun running uh, update. Um, yeah, so this is a tutorial. This is the. This is what you want to do to all of your races. Make templates of this race. This is going to help you. Um, it's going to help you make races uh, with ease and accuracy. And uh, yeah, you're gonna you're gonna need to do this. This isn't just about laying checkpoints for a race or anything. This is using checkpoints to your advantage. I have here. Um, when you start off a job straight off the bat, it'll be uh, the starting grid or checkpoints, whatever, will be facing north, true north. So you just lay your, lay your uh, trigger there and then lay this, that's your starting grid, and then lay a north and then you want to lay a south. This one's pointing west, east, that's pointing southeast and so on. Um, I'll show you how there is a building you can go by. This is how I did mine. Um, this building is true north here. Uh, that is a north checkpoint, as you can see, right? It's facing perfectly north with this building. Just lay that wherever you want. Yeah, I laid them all in. The, they're all in the. Uh, they're all in the airport there, just so I know where they all are. If you want to get south. Just come here or wherever. Um, oh, actually, yeah, I'll get a get a prop, a base prop to just put this over the building like this. Um, okay, that'll do. Right, so you want to make a south checkpoint. South checkpoint go like this. Just look at the cars. You, they'll rock together. See, look, that left one went up first. So we want to just do a bit of a slight adjustment. Just just tap in. There we go. We've got them both going up at the same time. See that? Like that. Boom. That would be facing south. And the way to check that is to lay the checkpoint then get a prop don't need to lay it or anything just go to advanced options rotation and check see it's gone 180 degrees true north is 0, 0.0 180 degrees and you carry on doing this um, this isn't probably this isn't um, direct up and down there so you need to move this prop here bring it down to this point here as you can see, look, we've got, well, you don't even really need it for this one, but so, and then to make it face east, go like this, look, and you can just, with this, you can just see the cars poking through, get them disappearing exactly the same point, that, there you go, look, see, the, that's exactly, so put that down, check it, by, there you go 270 degrees and so on you do the other one it'll be 90 degrees right and then all you do is start from 0, 0.0 then you move it 45 degrees to, to get 45 degrees use these edges here this one here and this one here and then um, I think this one here you can use this edge here for the other 45 and the other 45 and then you'll have the southeast southwest and all the rest of it um, that's how you, that's the way you want to get started once you've got all that done you know I've laid all mine out here this is my north south east and west and blah 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 what also a lot to do is get this area here this airport I think also possibly Zancudo um, I'm not entirely sure I haven't checked but this building here is straight with the airport you know straight with these runways and everything 
everything that you see all the buildings are facing the same way this one's a pretty square building so I've just put a prop underneath it like we did with the other building and I did the same again I picked up picked up this and rocked the cars as you can see they're both coming up at the same time that means it's pucker right and then what you do is you check by going to override like that and that's 330 degrees from that you can work out what it is 330 minus 180 and then you know minus 90 plus 270 all that um, and then to do the these are 45 degrees in between what I did was use this um, prop here as well for the 45 degrees because there isn't any 45 degree angles on the buildings so what I did was this is 330 so I moved it 45 degrees so 330 up to 360 is 30 degrees another 15 is 45 um, or easier to just show you is by clicking this one here no this one here and then this prop is so it's 330 minus 45 is 285 and just do it like that then you've got all of these for the airport you only need to do this once so if you just watch this tutorial try to stick it out to the very end I'll try not to waffle on too much I'll try to skip through it as much as I can but if you do this and then don't leave any um, stump props because you may want to use you may want to create a land race so you delete all these you know props here um, once you've got the checkpoints in place you're done and then the next step you want to do is let's delete that one just in case I forget it but I'll just go ahead and delete all the props is um, downtown here right so go to this building here all the buildings are facing the same way apart from this one building here it is facing the same way on this edge here but this is a, a another angle which you can find out just by you know, angling a prop and seeing what it is so all you do is the same premise just I'll just uh, do it like that and you want to move it it's going to be um, I think it's 70 degrees so look they're both coming up perfectly like that and that is oh oh what am I doing All right, pick this up drop it right have a look at your prop and it is 70 degrees and then you do 180 so that'd be 250 degrees and so forth you just do all that once you've got all those those done delete all the um, props save it and make uh, publish it just do the race obviously there's don't start doing the race because you've got to do this checkpoint here just pick up all your um, your building checkpoints your downtown checkpoints and take them back down take them back down to here and then you know lay them somewhere where you know they are and then save it I mean obviously these you have to move these off the building unless you build like a, a barge ramp up to here so you can get all these checkpoints but um, yeah and save it publish it label it put north south of checkpoint alignment or whatever and then um, make shitloads of copies and then you're done and then just keep making copies of it make you know 10 copies or something keep one of them saved and just work off them it's so much easier any look I made this um, well I made this that sign I did it in about 10 minutes um, you know to do all these I picked up the checkpoints you know and swivel all these props are perfectly and you know perpendicular to themselves or whatever um, it just makes life a lot easier when you're creating if you want to do some stuff precise and not mess about you know getting a prop here and trying to like line it up with the building or something you know trying to get it like that and it's just, you know just for precision and everything else it's just a lot easier so I hope this has helped school is now not in session I guess I might make a part two to this video um, I do have another checkpoint tutorial on races um, it's from the PS3 so it's a bit dated so 
I'm probably I will in probably within the next week I'm going to make one designed for races so we can you know because the checkpoints for a race is in it has to be the checkpoints have to be good you could have an amazing stunt perfectly smooth beautiful stunt flips all the rest of it and it's an absolute pile of dog shit because the checkpoints are shit the race is not the race is not the stunt the race is the race you drive around the city wherever you are on the track or whatever and then you hit a stunt most of a race is just doing checkpoints so they have got to be better they've got to be good they've got to be right and then the stunt you know, you can have just a m normal stunt, just a basic wall ride. If the checkpoints are good, people are going to like the race and replay it and like it, you know? So just look out for the tutorial. It will be coming out very shortly, within the next week. So all right, every everyone else, thanks for tuning in. Subscribe if you haven't. Um, hit the like button. Share with your friends. Share with, you know, anyone that you want to share the information with, I guess. And um, peace out. Signs out. Take it easy.